people like to talk about the housing market. It could be just a topic of conversation within your circle or within the industry. Usually, people will get bored with it, like usual, but it is very important to the economy. So much that I like posting about it ad nauseum. Nonetheless, I believe it is also important that you stay up to date with certain trends, things that are going on within the industry, the to-do and not-to-do lists of things in real estate. Where you're going, having a goal is also important. Knowing where you're at and where you can go is extremely important. And setting those goals and and accomplishing things uh, daily or weekly or yearly or every 30 years, depending on how you want to invest your real estate dollars. Uh, That being said, there's not really a housing market crash. Uh, There won't be a housing market crash. In order for something to crash, it has to almost build up to a point where it's unstable and fall over to crash like a bubble. Those two things are kind of synonymous, housing housing market crashes and housing market bubbles. And I don't, we're never gonna see, I don't think, for a while, this is my prediction, uh, for a while I don't think we're going to see a crash or a bubble burst for quite some time. Uh, the, the things that burst happened at the 25 year mark of many, many mortgages. Uh, right now you're having so much relief in the mortgage industry, there is actually just a housing market backup. And what I mean by that is that so many people want to get into the housing market but they're not able to because of risky lending in the in the past, as, as we spoke of, the housing market crashed back in 2006 and seven, where they were trading on the default of mortgages. So one thing's for sure is that the practices of Wall Street, they don't really necessarily go away. They just kind of change different tactics and different I want to say names, just names, tactics over time, but those things aren't going to go away. There's going to be people over there that are going to be super risky. They're going to be doing things that other people aren't going to be doing. That's going to to be in every industry. So what you are also seeing is that there's a tremendous amount of demand for quality rentals. I've been in the rental industry since I was 18, starting on my own, but uh, was coached and mentored by my family growing up and friends that that were also in the industry. And I continue to receive help from them, new acquaintances, new business partners, people that are also doing that same thing. And if you have any questions or you have any concerns about real estate, of course, I'm always out here to help. You you can always shoot me a text or, you know, uh, give me a phone call, I don't don't mind. Yeah, so the crash, not gonna happen. We've got things in place since 2006, 2007 in the mortgage industry that does not let that happen. In fact, that is the industry that's backing things up a little bit because they're they're so stringent on their lending right now. You're just seeing people not able to get loans because the the unavailability of credit or too high of a risk for one reason or the other, the bank's not gonna lend. And you're gonna see the fact that if you're going out and buying houses, there's gonna be six or seven people that are going to be there as well sometimes, you're going to be bumping into them. You're going to be sizing each other up. Uh, You're going to be uh, debating on should you go up or down or or dump the house and move to the next one and you don't know if the next one's going to come about. Well, the answer to that is is it will. (laughs) Eventually, there's every year there's ebbs and flows of when people are buying, when people are not buying. I could also talk to you about that. At the end of the day though, when you see that little kid he's smiling at you from the window of his house, he's having fun. Uh, the parents are happy, they're coming home from work, they have a, a place to stay. Uh, that's pretty much my why for the industry is that you know we're providing this service to people. And I, I like to go above and beyond the service I provide. I give a lot of information out for free. Ultimately, it's just for the good of all real estate and trying to uh, make people overall happy in the future and, and in the present. So if you have any questions, therefore, contact me. 
Robley, clickrobley.realtor. Hope you all have a great rest of your summer.